This video is part one of the series on excessive exercise and happy theory. According to happy theory, masturbation will make a human being blind and crippled. There are other activities that either cause or are associated with the same symptoms as those caused by masturbation. Excessive sex, injection of drugs, snorting of drugs, anorexia, and excessive exercise are all associated with the same changes to the body as those caused by masturbation. This video will present an example of the physical changes caused to a human body by excessive exercise. Here is a picture of the example human being for this video. The young man shown in this picture was famous for tough guy roles in the movies. The young man would have had to exercise vigorously to make his body look tough in the movies. That fact supports the claim by Happy Theory that the physical changes exhibited by the body of the young man are due to excessive exercise. The most obvious change that masturbation or excessive exercise will inflict on the human body is that they will make the body asymmetric. The word asymmetric means the body is not the same on both sides. The line superimposed on the approximate center of the body in this picture clearly shows that the body is asymmetric. The left side of the body is mostly erect, while the right side of the body is tilted down to the right. Another change caused to the body by masturbation or excessive exercise is that one eye will go blind. This picture shows a close-up of the face of the example human being. The right eye looks slightly bigger and more open than the left eye does. The left eye will be the eye that eventually goes blind because the left eye is the one that is getting smaller. Uneven shoulders are also a common change to the body that is caused by masturbation or excessive exercise. The right shoulder of the example human being is much lower than the left shoulder. Another common change caused by excessive exercise and masturbation is that one of the arms will become crippled. The right arm in this picture gives the impression that it is so long that the right hand was cut off of the bottom of the picture. The left arm gives the impression of being shorter because the entire left hand is visible. It is also common for masturbation or excessive exercise to cripple one of the legs. Most of the legs have been cut off at the bottom of the picture. The part of the legs that are visible though can be used to make educated observations about the condition of the legs. The right leg looks like it is firmly planted on the ground with all of the body weight leaning onto it. The left leg is lifted up as if it is being pulled upwards by a hot air balloon. According to Happy Theory, the left leg is crippled because it is not grounded. The word grounded means what it sounds like, something that is firmly planted on the ground. The right leg is grounded because it looks firmly planted on the ground. The left leg is not grounded because it is floating up above the ground. Excessive exercise or masturbation will usually cause the head to jut forward as highlighted in this picture. The head also moves to the right so the head is no longer aligned with the center of the torso. There is one overall change of the body that accounts for all of the individual changes that have been listed up to this point. The entire body looks like it follows a curve to the right. The curving of the entire body to the right pulls the head to the right, it forces the right shoulder downwards, it makes the right arm look longer, it makes the left arm look like it is being pulled upwards, and it makes the left leg look like it is being pulled upwards. The curve of the entire body to the right makes it tempting to believe that an accurate response to the question, how does masturbation or excessive exercise change the human body, would be to say that Excessive exercise or masturbation makes the human body curve to one side or the other. That answer might be accurate as far as it goes, but it is not a complete answer. The question that has not been answered is, 
Exactly what does masturbation or excessive exercise do to the human body that makes the body curve to one side or the other? This video is not going to provide an answer to that question. Instead, the next part of the video will use a theoretical model of the human body to provide one way to visualize why excessive exercise has produced the exact pattern of changes in the example human body that it has. One of the theoretical models of the human body created for happy theory is the two snakes view of the human body. According to the two snakes view of the human body, the human body can be treated as two large snakes located as shown by the lines in this picture. The head of each snake corresponds to the head of the human body. The tail of each snake corresponds to the feet and the center of each snake corresponds to the side of the torso opposite the side of the body that the head and tail of each snake are on. Here is the picture of the example human being with two lines superimposed on his body to represent the two snakes from the two snakes view of the human body. The right side of the torso is shorter than the left side. Because the body of the snake is supposed to represent the human body, the body of the snake needs to be shortened to match the short right side of the human torso. This picture shows a short line representing the shortened middle section of the snake body that now matches the shortened right side of the human torso. If the middle section of the snake is shortened, the head and tail of the snake would be pulled backwards towards the shortened middle section of the snake. A shortened head and tail have been added to the shortened middle section of the snake in this picture. The shortened head of the snake does not go all the way up into the human head and the shortened tail of the snake does not go as far down into the left leg as they did in the picture demonstrating the normal two snakes view of the human body. Because the snakes represent the human body, if the head and tail of the snake move towards the right side of the body, then the head and the left leg of the example human being should also move towards the right side of the body if the two snakes view of the human body is an accurate theoretical model. The head of the human being has moved towards the right side of the body. The left leg has moved up towards the right side of the body. Two of the changes to the real-life example human being match the changes predicted by the two snakes view of the human body. The penis, which is involved in masturbation, can be seen on the right side of the body. The right side of the body is also the side of the body that exhibited all of the changes that were attributed to excessive exercise. According to Happy Theory, there is a relationship between all of the excessive exercise changes being on the right side of the body and the visibility of the penis on the right side of the body. Discovering what that relationship is will help the curious person understand why excessive exercise and masturbation both cause similar changes to the human body. The final piece of evidence connecting masturbation and excessive exercise to the same physical changes to the human body is this picture of a man in a sexual advertisement. Because the picture was created for sexual reasons, it is reasonable to believe his body right now is under the influence of sexual stimulation. This picture compares the excessive exercise example human being to the sexually stimulated human being. Both bodies have almost the exact same look. Both men lean to the right. Most of the body weight of both men is on their right leg. The left legs of both men look like they are moving upwards. The right arm of both men looks longer than the left arm. The right shoulder of both men is lower than the left shoulder. The penis is on the right side of the body of both men. The similarity of changes to the body between the example excessive exercise human being and the example sexually stimulated human being are further cooperation for the claim by happy theory that masturbation and excessive exercise cause similar changes to the human body.